Those are the things that drive your body to feel better, that create more energy, that give you the energy to do the things that you're trying to accomplish. And Deb Vandelinder asks, I like this philosophy. The hard part is sticking to it in the rough times. What's the best tool for keeping this type of focus on the daily agenda? Um, my husband Tarek will drop and do 20 push-ups if he's not feeling good, which I always find really humorous. He just did it yesterday. I was talking to him and he dropped down and did push-ups and he wanted to change his state quickly to feel better. And um, I think movement is the easiest way to do it. If I can't move, the second thing I'll do is I'll put on music that I love to just change my thinking. Um, I also love meditating. Um, and I, I think um, what I've found from the people that I've been mentored by and I've worked with at a higher level is they're constantly doing things every day to take care of themselves. Um, it's often in simple things, like Jake said, breathing, drinking water, trying to get sleep, um, eating healthier foods, exercising. Those are the things that drive your body to feel better, that create more energy, that give you the energy to do the things that you're trying to accomplish. And, you know, for me, I, um, I love drinking juices and things that give me more energy because I have more things on my list that I want to do than I know I have time and sometimes energy. So I'm always trying to pump up my energy in the best, most natural way possible.